guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting reading to episode 3 and 4 of Working, so let's go ahead and get started with episode 3 in 3, 2, 1, go. How many times is my heater gonna Yeah, because she's not afraid of the female customers. Oh, it's possible. But, I mean, it's important, though. <laughs> Who told you? Press out to them. <laughs> okay, like how different because he's your coworker. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah, but I think Yachiro is in love with the manager, so, um, yeah, I've been wondering that, too, like, hmm. Because I don't think she do that for cosplay. Y'all don't know Wait, wait, time out. <laughs> I mean, still, like, <laughs> I can't. <laughs> like, Shoko is so lazy, but, like, that's so young, maybe something made him hungry. <laughs> that is what. Oh my god. Then go with it, like, somewhere. <laughs> I mean, because, yeah, what the heck is going to happen when you run out of food? You go and tell the customers, oh, hey, we ain't got anything in here. <laughs> I mean, but, like, seriously, let's think about that real quick. I mean, honestly, if I can compare. <laughs> you know, like, I mean. It's like how it freaking Dark Lord would be three <laughs> with Koki TV. Talking about me, my mom and shit. I mean, but like the fact is that Kyoko is so freaking lazy, and then she's like, "Yeah, I got you. Know, I'm, I'm hungry." Like, and I got you. Just goes out in her way to just make her something to eat. But like, damn, you get and then you use all the food. <laughs> what the fuck? I can't. Oh my god. Like, this child, oh my god. Yeah, but seriously, what you gonna do if the customers come? And they're like, okay, I'm hungry. And <laughs> they come up and be like, hi, let me take your order. But before we start, we don't really have anything to eat right now. Couldn't be me. I just feel like, all right, do something. <laughs> my mother would probably be like, hold up, wait, 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 wait. 
I just be over here like, because like you know when you go to a food, when you go to a restaurant and there's always like when somebody get something wrong it's happened to me before and the one thing i've never done is yelled at someone like there's no reason for me to yell at somebody but oh my god i've seen so many people yell at someone over there and i'm like hold on wait like it's not that big of a deal you can still get it free I mean, yeah, what? I mean, she's like Liz from Is the Order a Rabbit because she was carrying around a, a fake gun. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she really does. Oh, so you just carried it to school. Oh, Jesus. She's been in debt with her ever since. Oh my god. <laughs> I was thinking that they knew each other ever since they were kids that you would just keep Because <laughs> I I'm thinking, oh, they're probably the same age. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god.
So we got the manager, manager, and then the manager, and then. <laughs> I'm guessing you're out of <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> oh, oh, it's Lord, let me stop. <laughs> The hell? Oh. <laughs> but wait, Anna, can we get a little more information on your missing wife, though? I mean... That's what I want to know. Oh, I know someone like that. Ain't me, but I know someone. <laughs> it's worse when you get lost in the parking lot. Girl, you not in oh my lord. Oh my
Oh my god, this girl. <laughs> Well, you know, I'm glad that this episode finally goes into the details of these two, because I'm like, mm. <laughs> they're a couple of my book, no matter what. <laughs> oh, well, um, you better not be here when she comes. Cause she might kick your ass. None of them bite too well. Hmm? Oh, are you sick? That's the girlfriend, you know, the relationship ish. Oh my god. <laughs> when your significant other just knows. <laughs> Are we sure that Calcuson is actually going to be able to get through this? Because I mean... Oh my god! Maybe you should just wash the dishes instead of drying them? Or, um... Well, yeah, now we know, but, um... Okay. Hmm? Yeah, you have to go feed her. No! Give it to Yachino! Oh my god, girl! You and some. I don't know if you should, should eat off the same spoon. Exactly. Maybe. Uh, oh my God. No, Kyoko. You would think she would be sick now. Yeah, and then you have to reorder ingredients and that costs like how much money? Huh. Or just, okay, you know what? She got money, right? Okay. Go to the freaking store.
Oh, because you're old. You know, basically, you got the short end of the stick with your employees. <laughs> you got to feel bad for him, though, because, like, oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. But, okay, I'm happy that we learned about Mahita and her, you know, issue. Um... We kind of hope that this whole entire series, she's, you know, by the end of this, that, you know, she's kind of cured. <laughs> I don't know what to say about this episode. Honestly, it went by too quickly. <laughs> oh my god, what was this episode? <laughs> I can't. What was this episode? Oh my god. But honestly, it really went by way too fast. But I'm glad that we got to know the connection of Coco and Yachino. I mean, yes, in my opinion, they are girlfriends. Even though Kyoko is older than Yachino. But it's okay. It's fine. <laughs> I just, I mean, because, like, I, I had been thinking about this ever since I watched this last weekend. And I was like, okay, well, what's the connection between these two? I was just thinking, like, okay, well, maybe they went to school with each other, possibly. Maybe they got they both in college. Who did you hear? My hitter, please don't. Oh my god. This is how he died and became the Persona 5 protagonist. Mm -hmm. I literally thought we were gonna go almost the whole episode. <laughs> God, you know some bad for him. Like, mm. damn, he will be getting hit every single episode of this dang series. Like, oh damn, mm. Mm. she need an intervention. <laughs> she needs something. Like, oh my god. I mean, like, I, I love Mahina. She's a very three episodes in, and she's a very interesting character, my girl. <laughs> Oh my god, I can't breathe. <laughs> it's just, it, it's so, now knowing everything of what just happened, especially in the first few minutes of this episode, and learning about her issue and then her father, I mean, damn. <laughs> Girl, oh my god. Well, hold on, I just want to know, who told her that men were dangerous? Was it her mom? <laughs> Somebody had to tell her, like, oh my god, girl, oh Jesus Christ, I can't, I, 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 I mean, mm. Mm. <laughs> let 
let me just say this. Not all men and women are dangerous. Yes, there are some dangerous men and women, but you, you know, you just got to figure it out who it is, you know. And that's why sometimes, yeah, you got to carry something with you at all times because you never know what the hell is going to happen. You never know literally who is going to want to follow you, whether it's in a freaking store or just out anywhere. And you know, yeah, maybe you have to. I'm not saying you gotta, like, you know, kill somebody. Don't do that, please. No, 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 no. But maybe, yeah, you just need to take something and be like, ah, and then you just need to go in the car, call the police, and then, yeah, go home. Lock your doors. It's like that. But, I mean, seriously, she, we, we need an intervention on her. I mean, <laughs> it just, it takes time and training and just for her to feel comfortable around these guys. I mean, she's comfortable around everyone all the guys in some sort of way but like with um <laughs> with Sarka. and with Oto it really it's more not really as much as Oto because I feel like they're fine as of right now but just you know our main boy like he just getting his butt kicked every single time they're near each other. And, I mean, even though she was cowering behind him, like, mm, that's okay. I mean, she she's working on it, A, for effort. I just, I hope and pray that by the end of this series, you know, she all right. <laughs> because she would look at her and you just be like, one day she is going to beat the crap out of a customer. And then next thing you know, what if the customer sues? And it's just going to be like... Uh, <laughs> like, what do you do then? Like, oh my god, I'm sorry. Like, oh god, the customer's always right. <laughs> I'm so stupid. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, but go ahead and pause the video, and I'll see you guys in one second for episode four. Okay, episode four and three. Two, one, go. Hmm? What's You want to call the police? The hospital? Oh, yeah, she's drunk. Your mom, your sister? Oh, and just someone who lives in the neighborhood. Well, you know, Sota, why don't you go ahead and take her home? I mean, since you know her. Oh, you're going to be my cutest best friend. Uh huh, uh huh. Yeah, uh huh, yep. And right on that face. I 
I mean, okay. You know what? <laughs> my hero is all the girls from Persona 5, like, when it's Valentine's Day, and you're like, hmm, I'm gonna go ahead and be a, a man whore, and I'm gonna date everybody. Valentine's Day comes, and then it's the next day, you're sp you spend time with one person. Next day, all the women come, and you just get your ass <laughs> <laughs> oh Jesus Christ, this woman I hate. <laughs> Oh my god. You know, this is just Ozzy Magadayo and drugs. <laughs> Okay, well, that's good. So, yeah. You just hope your sister doesn't really, you know. But see, I feel like somebody else is going to find out about that photo. Like, if my hero doesn't open her mouth, we know his sister's probably going to come drunk one day again and be like, hey, look at all these pictures I have. <laughs> Uh-huh, yeah, Bobby. I'm busy. I I'm sorry. That my dog is harassing you. You about that? Probably does. I mean, it, it seems like blackmail is his forte. So much fun about you. See, he would be the one that would rat somebody out. <laughs> Yeah. 
has to. But yeah, I mean, that's a complicated relationship. <laughs> and so, but you are everywhere. I mean, Jesus. with the damn fireworks. I mean, come on, it's six o'clock at night. It ain't even night, it's some daytime here in Florida. And you know it? I, I just feel like you just made it more complicated. Oh, Jesus. No, no, no. Oh, my God. Hey, we think you would do that at home. Oh my god, my hair! <laughs> oh I had a feeling, but I was like, no, let me die it real quick.
Let's help your oh, is she drunk already? Yeah, both. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but now it's dirty again. Oh my god, I'm not like, ooh, girl, I mean, you give sugar a rough of your money. Oh my god. So you got a drunk sister and a girl and a novelist sister. Oh my lord. Oh. Okay, so a lawyer and all those truck. Okay, we can work with that. Okay, Jesus. And she's the younger, isn't she? <laughs> the youngest. She's so cute. Oh, well, dang, your dad. Oh, what sucks? Oh my god, don't make me cry. I don't want to cry. This is supposed to be a happy anime. This is supposed to be funny. Oh, god, it's so precious. <laughs> oh, she is short. <laughs> I mean, she ain't popular short, but... <laughs> oh my god, please stop sweating like that. I was like, mm. At first, I thought he was salivating, but like, um... <laughs> Oh my god, is this, is this sister coming? Mm -hmm. I mean, hey, maybe some men like to be bossed by women. It's fine.
I mean, she got a mean right hug. I mean, oh God, I, I hate to be a guy and like walking down an alley by myself and seeing her. Mm -hmm. You don't have to see Oh well, no, there she is. So I'm going to just remember, Bob and me, duck, and then just don't punch her because you don't need her to, like, you know, sue you for something. But just Bob and we just know that. No, you're fine. You're okay. You just, you know, you maybe want some ointment on that thing. Reduce the swelling and redness. Oh, God. But it's kind of obvious you have a crush on him. We all knew that, though. Oh, Jesus. He, oh, God. He is beating him. Oh, okay. Um, Please stop. You're going to hurt him really bad. Are you okay? Did you lose your pride as a man? Oh God. <laughs> it would be Valentine's Day. Of course, Yashida would have something like immediately. Beans. The much you give Kyoko chocolate? But wait, Popular, did you buy chocolate as well? Oh, God. Now, now hand it to him. Hand it to him. Oh, God, no, no, no. Okay, you want to try again, though? <laughs> like I said, she trying a hey, forever. Oh my god, <laughs> cheer, cheer her on, please, every week, no matter what. She is trying her best. Like, girl, you know, she's gonna be a better person by the end of this series. We all know it. I, I hope so, really, because like. There are moments where I have doubts on her. Like, girl, I, I felt like, you know, she just needs to learn that hitting a guy, is, it's not the answer. Just, you know, mm -hmm. <laughs> and so many needs to learn to bob and weave and duck and then, you know, move out of the way so that he doesn't get hurt. I mean, because she, like, oh, she beat his behind. Like, I mean, mm. <laughs> Like, oh, God, I mean, she, oh, she, like, brutally murdered him without killing him, though. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm.
<laughs> what was this episode? <laughs> but okay, seeing his family and the fact that he's the only boy out of all these females, it makes me wonder, like, how did his father die? What in the world happened? Like, I mean, dang, if he has to be the man of the house, but like, oh my god. Well, you can put it in the freezer. <laughs> I, I feel like she's going to explain what I like. Oh, God. See, I told you. But it was you. That's okay. with this show. This is too fucking cute. It's making hilarious. It's everything that I wanted, but like, oh my god, I can't. <laughs> I'm mocking him. Like, girl, I love her so much, but like, oh god. I just, I still have that fear, but I mean, mm, I feel like there's gonna be a point where like, she's gonna realize like, yeah, but like, can, can we talk about the fact that she did good on her tests, on her exams? Like, oh, but like, the fact is that most of her teachers are male, like, mm. You poor baby. I mean, she can't win. Like, oh, you <laughs> the odds are not in her favor, like, no matter what. But, I mean, like I said, she slowly but surely, she's getting it. And it's just going to take a little while. Three seasons. <laughs> Maybe, like, it, it is three seasons, right? Three, four seasons? I don't really remember. I have to go back and look. Three seasons, probably. Um, But, yeah! <laughs> but she'll get it. It's okay. I mean, I'm hoping that this next episode we do, like... What I really want at the end of the day, like with the situation of popular and um, Sota, like I want them to go on a date. Just one little episode that'll just make me so happy. Like honestly, they look so freaking cute together. But I think if they went on a date, like I, I feel like somebody will see him and then instantly like a police officer is going to come up like, sir, you're going to have to come with me. And then I'm just going to be over here like, oh my God, like... <laughs> But, like, she's not a child with a... <laughs> oh, my God. If that happens, I will die. <laughs> like, that ass. Okay. I want to talk about something real quick. And it ha it doesn't really... It, in a way, it has to do with this series because of the fact is... Who owns the rights to this series? Not really season one and season two, but the last season. Okay. So, last night... Um, finally, after two years of waiting for this anime to finally get a dub, it is official that Persona 5 the Animation is getting a dub. And so I found out that not only this show, but P5 the Anime are both owned by Aniplex of America. And so I'm like, oh snap, like yes, like I'm getting my like, my English dub, I'm getting my character for the game, finally getting dub, we're gonna hear Joker like literally freaking talk, not hearing him as freaking Lelouch V Britannia like every freaking minute even though I loved it. But I was like, we're gonna hear the English VA as this character for 20, 28 episodes, technically 26, and two OVAs and stuff like that. Then I go look at the price. And if you have followed me on Twitter, like, if you saw me last night on the 4th of July, but by the time this has come out, it'll be a week later, almost a week later, um, I was going off. Like, everybody was going off. They want us. I, I, I'm not even going to pay this because this is way too inexpensive. And I'm like, mm-mm, $300 <laughs> on this 26 episode plus two OVAs, really nice box set, I'm just saying. But for 26 episodes and two OVAs, $300. Like, I mean, that's a little too expensive. And I mean, this is like the same people, um, when I was watching, uh, the Monogatari series, who also own that ish. And I was like, oh man, like, how much is this? And everybody was like, oh, it's expensive. And then I went to go look for it myself one day and I was like, dude, like, oh my god. This series is so expensive. That's why you can't even go ahead and buy Sora Online. Like, any other freaking season of Sora Online. You can't buy Promise Neverland because Promise Neverland is also owned by them. It, it's just, like, oh my god. Like, I wanted to buy Cells at Work. They wanted $200 for Cells at Work. And I was like, hold up. Mm, like, mm, not in my budget, baby. Like, can we talk about Funimation and Viz Media for one second? And how the fact is, like, 
they do good ish and their quality is good and they can sell it for much cheaper than $300. And I mean, I can't believe I'm getting angry about this still because it's been like what? I think maybe almost 12 to 24 hours after this, and I hate the fact that I'm getting angry on this, but, like, let's say I wanted to buy this show, and I mean, because it's a really good series, and even though the first half, like, the first two seasons are owned by Ms. America, it's a lot easier to go ahead and buy that, but, like, to buy that final season, I really wouldn't want to, because then you never know how much they're gonna price that up! I mean, like, oh my god, like, hello? <laughs> like, oh! I mean... And this is why people do what they do with the with the anime. I mean, like, ooh, like you telling me, like, uh, like there, there's gonna be someone who wants to get in, into Persona Five, and they're gonna be like, well, instead of me spending three hundred dollars on a used PlayStation Four and possibly Persona Five the Royal, I'm just gonna spend three hundred dollars on this nice box set of the anime and watch that people are literally trying to do that on twitter and i'm like are you fucking kidding me like no like please go play the game if you have not played persona 5 either just normal vanilla version or royal go do that i mean it's really good i mean heck if you probably follow me you've probably seen spoilers up because i i mean the game has been out how long um so yeah there's gonna be spoilers no matter what i'm just saying but i mean seriously please go play that like don't don't give them do not give aniplex three hundred dollars worth for a nice box set 26 episodes two ovas and promotional cards like no please don't do that like if you really think it's worth it then go ahead but like at the end of the day look my switch was three hundred dollars and if I had to choose between any console and the P5 anime box set, I would choose a console over that thing. Unless, like, they literally... And I really think Aniplex is probably going to look at this, like, any tweets that they've gotten from, like, the past 24 hours or even 12 hours, but a week. And they're probably going to put that price down. But, yeah, that's my little rant that I wanted to put. But, yeah, both of these episodes were freaking awesome and I loved it. I just really wanted to talk about that and because last night when I found out that they had the rights to this as well I was like dang I can literally just kiss you know owning this series for myself like goodbye because it, it's ridiculous to me and I hate the fact that the, they're the only company out of the three companies freaking Funimation Viz and them who charge like so much and then you wonder why people do what they do. I, I can't. I mean, why? <laughs> What's the problem? Oh my god, like, please, can we have a talk about that? <laughs> but yeah, I'm sorry, we're over. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to you towards episodes three and four of season one of Working. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like, it really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Marshall Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for Patreons and next Thursday for everybody else for episodes five and six. Bye, guys.